All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to God of War Ragnarok. Still nothing for the heavy for this either, but uh, let's uh. If you are still bound, how will you travel? Go with Freya. I crafted a protection ward that'll keep me from being pulled out of the realm. It should hold until I find what I need. And what is that? The source of the magic that binds me to Midgard. We're going to find it and destroy it. I will help you. But it will not change what I have done. I know. That's why I still might kill you when this is over. Lovely. Lovely ending. Ain't going nowhere without this. Where would you muck spouts even be without me? What is it you expect to need Kratos for, Highness? Clearly you've been quite capable of breaking Odin's curses on your own. The other curses grew weak from Thimble Winter, but I still needed help to break them. This one is held strong. So all that trying to kill him, that's just your goddessy way of asking for help? I don't ah. recall asking you to come along. It's because you didn't. I got an old drinking buddy I've been meaning to look up once this joint were back on the map. Got a hunch lending you mokes a hand's gonna end me up where I'm going. And what makes you think that? Cause last I heard tell, she was running with that beef wit brother of yours. Freyr... is not a part of this. Well, my hunch says otherwise. Scrote, too. I'm <laughs> a scrote. Oh, God. Love him so much. Feels it in the scrote. I can feel the pool of the binding curse. Holy its shit. source is further in. Follow me. Right. Muggier than a moonful hind shit pit out here. And nearly as fragrant. I suppose Fimble Winter's to blame. But if it helps these two find peace. This is a temporary alliance, Mimir. Anything beyond that would require trust. Oh, please. You know damn well Kratos isn't the true cause of your suffering. You're both as much a part of my suffering as anyone. Come on. Let's find a way forward. Whatever you say, yeah, you just, uh... Through here. Trying to blame people for partially oh, no. what are your mistakes. Something's wrong. My spell, I can feel it slipping. Well, that's Thimble Winter for you. You don't understand. I'll be torn from the realm. What can be done? Something I was hoping to avoid. Okay. Seems I don't have much choice. Falcon! Come on, then. You had a way around Odin's curse this whole time. No. I discovered it once you unlocked realm travel. And it solves very little. This form is extremely limiting. Hey, uh, how's about a riddle to take your mind off? I'm in What no... runs with no legs? Easy, uh, I know. You'll have to try harder than that, bro. Just you wait, smart guy. Okay, and knows that that works too, I guess. <laughs> Place is quite ah. abandoned. Fuck. What the hell Watch is that? Watch where you're going. The plants are extra aggressive in this humidity. Aggressive? Recognize this market. Villages would meet and trade here. Why'd they not be? Okay. Now what we got here? Oh! Oh God! What the hell was that? Shit. Come on! Right. 
crowd control time. Woo! But don't that get the old juices flowing? Forgot how much I like scrapping dirty. Uh huh. Let's check over here. Ooh. Boy, you don't miss a scrap of loot, do you? Where has everyone gone, I wonder? They must have withdrawn, hidden themselves out in the wilds, and covered their tracks with magic. From who? No way of knowing how many are left or how to reach them. Aesir ran cockshot all over this place, huh? You can thank Mimir for that. War with the Vanir was never my idea. My idea was brokering the marriage to end it. A great success that was. Obviously, the peace was no less a disaster than the marriage. Did he invade again as soon as I was exiled? It's possible he did. We don't know. A market, huh? Looks like they sure left behind a lot of goodies. Shame to let them collect dust. That's one way of looking at it. Uh. Hmm. Can I jump? Yeah, I can. Okay. Damn it, really? Ugh. Sorry about that. Pretty sure there's loot you're missing. If you want to hunt around him. He's just real adamant about me doing it. Well, there's that there, and that's it. Huh? <laughs> oh shit! What the hell? Hey! Calling all peckers! <laughs> On your left! <laughs> They're behind you! <laughs> Back memories of that red fancy huh. folks and quality meats. Though I remember your brother stirring up an awful scene. Why do you keep bringing him up? My brother is no concern of yours. Do you understand? Oh, I understand plenty. Okay, she's got a uh, sore, sore spot for Thrain. Oh damn, I can't get down there yet. Yeah. Is Brock under attack? What's this? Life grows more dangerous the further we go. Hope you're up for it, dwarf. Listen, I know how bad it can get with one's own kin. 
Sindri and I were on the out so long, it was like not having a brother at all. Now, nah, I take some of the fall for that on account of me walking out. But it never stopped me blaming him most. Does <laughs> this sound familiar so far? And what is your point? <laughs> My point is, that weren't the end all of things after all. Once we got our heads right, it was like no time had passed. He went straight back to being as big a pain in my ass as he ever was. That's family. You gotta keep them close, or they make you good and crazy. Why do you think I need to hear any of this right now? My focus is on regaining my freedom, and I have no intention of being distracted. Look, all I'm saying is, you happen to find yourself talking to your brother. Maybe the worst words said between you don't have to be the last one said. Enough. When the day comes to face Freya again, it will be when I am standing on my feet and free. You understand me? It will not be while I'm stuck in this preposterous situation. Got a case of pride, I guess. Yeah, she does. Hope yours clears up quicker than mine did. A touching story, that was. Bite me. You will. <laughs> He said bite. Okay, I can't throw it. What is the other, uh... Oh! Did I miss an, any other one? No, I didn't. Okay. What did Odin do to drive everyone away? What weapons did he make the dwarves build him? How much was just Mjolnir? Can one man do this much damage? Yeah. Depends on the weapon and the man. Shiny. This river. It used to be filled with boats of people visiting from different villages. I've never seen it so empty. Tis the cost of war. What is this? Not now, brother. We've got company. Get through that. That's a giant's brooch. Oh, God. What the hell? Carry that, bastard! Calling all pecker strips! Take it off, man! You've got this! Things. Not now, brother. We've got company. 
One of them hairy ass bastards! Oh, who you think you are, huh? You don't even know what's gonna happen! Nasty hit! Jesus you are right! messing me up they don't seem to take any damage from uh, huh? uh huh? blades of chaos what is this not now brother we've got company one of them hairy ass bastards <laughs> ah! 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 And you want to keep your insides inside. Yeah! All yours, big guy. Your people not receiving visitors? I wouldn't know. Oh. They're not my people anymore. Give me a boost. <clears throat> you don't go telling no one about that. Uh oh. Uh oh, what? Yeah! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. He should probably go get him. Keep your guard up.
Oh, it's a, like a hunting trap. Quiet. Now, what do we have here? Oh, one eye, send another god to do his dirty work. Thor, too busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing, then. All right. No, no. No need for threats, brother. Oh, I know that voice. <laughs> you know, I'd cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye. Oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. He sold my sister to that prick. We broke it a piece. Oh. Did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me. I guess we'll settle for blood. Stop! What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Ingvi. There's no time to explain, just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. You can't undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. So, you serve my sister. Oh. Huh. Don't we all? Put him down. What's with leaving me hanging like that? Trusty hag. Oh, can it, Blubber? Come here. Well, hello. Well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. <laughs> Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Fair. Yeah, in a second. <laughs> uh, Brock, <coughs> what are you Just cause I hug you don't mean I ain't still sore at you squabbling sandpipers. We fixed it so you can come and go between the realms whenever you please. You're very welcome. Go. This here's my family, and I mean much to you, but I mean plenty to me. It does too mean something to me. Otherwise, I wouldn't have made up with my bunker head brother. Five million moon beans. I didn't realize the Hulk brothers were hmm. back in business. We're even like a proper family. So don't tell me! Oh, okay, well, well, then you can help me at the forge while you spill everything. Belt of courage. Now, Brock, ain't you gonna introduce me to this tall glass of milk you got for a bodyguard? Of course I was gonna! Oh, That's Kratos! milk. Oh, you can call him whatever pops into your head. Kratos, Lunda, we go back. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. Hey, where's the armor I made you? I used it. I busted my shapely hunkers, forging every manner of breastplate and pauldron in all of creation. And yet now you stand before me, two steps from butt ass naked. Maybe this go around using a little more carefully, huh? I will not. <laughs> they keep going. Ready through when this. you are.
Oh, I can craft this stuff now? Okay. Now don't go get yourself killed. Oh, wait. Hear me? Wait, Very wait, well. Wait. Okay. What about the blades? Okay. What? You just came to stare? We wish this camp kept secret. Understood. I will not compromise it. No, we wouldn't dare. Is it? Good. Is he one of the travelers? And is this a Hello, dark and servant of Freya? Do not speak to him. Shouldn't you be moving along now, stranger? Perhaps he can help. There's no reason to be unfriendly. I can think of at least a dozen. Leave us. Tend to your bird. Huh. Interesting. Oh, here he is. Sorry we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. I'm pretty used to only seeing Aesir in these parts. Don't typically get friendly faces. That... That is a friendly face, right? His name is Kratos, and no. The Aesir are in Vanaheim. Yeah, we've been occupied since... Uh, I lost count. What is your plan? Still kind of working on it. Mm -hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. Well, I'll take what I can get. Your mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. Smoother, really? I, I like having you around. <laughs> hey, Kratos. As long as you're working for my sister, carefully you don't screw up. She's not too big on forgiveness. A bit late for that one, I'm afraid. Right. All right, let's see what we've got here. Tell me about your army. Oh, you're looking at it. What, you five? Against Odin's army? Well, six if you count the dog. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> you know their oh, number. Lord. Okay. <gasps> Well, we haven't figured that one out yet, so never mind. No. Let's have a look at the map then. I literally can't read it without Mimir being with me. Okay. All right. Well, at least I think we'll probably get whatever that piece of equipment is from this realm, since it's everywhere, it seems. Now that the distractions are out of the way. I have words, if you would hear them. Speak then. With anger you feel for your brother. I know it well. You have a brother? His name was Demos. When we were boys, he was taken by two gods obsessed with prophecy. The gods of my homeland seldom left survivors. So by the time I learned he had lived, it was too late for amends. His anger poisoned him against me. But I never stopped loving my brother. You think my anger is irrational? You've known Freya for mere moments and already you're taking his side? I am not taking his- No. You're just sharing your thoughts on a subject you know nothing about. Yeah, that's kind of what he asked me if he could do when you just let him speak. Hmm. 
An ancient. I suppose we'll leave it be. Or not. Grab what is dropped and throw it. Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. Start and rage. Let's switch that over. Okay. Oh god, oh god. It's a wonder I've had such difficulty killing you. Is she really gonna start talking shit now? <laughs> like, you're a fucking bird. I could just kill you. Like, I know that wouldn't be the, the the noble or paragon thing to do, but I don't have to be here. <laughs> Kratos offered to help you. I know what you're doing. Trying to play on my sympathies in the hope I let you live. I am only trying to help. The mistakes of the past need not be repeated. I don't need to hear about your mistakes. I've made enough of my own, thanks. <laughs> How the hell do I get over there? No, that was a thing. Everyone is so eager to advise me. As if any of you know me or what I need. The biggest loss in my life is due to you saving me when I specifically told you not to. Well, it was my family, 
My mess. I know Balder wasn't perfect, but he was mine. I know. You know? You think you can even begin to understand the pain of losing a child? Yes. I do. There was another. Before Atreus? Her name was Calliope. Calliope? What happened? It was long ago. Never mind. I shouldn't have asked. Yeah, it sounds like you kind of fucked around and found out, isn't it? <laughs> haven't seen any actual Asgardians here. Aim, Herr Jarl! So they do occupy
Okay. We need to get to that watchtower. We'll have to go through the valley, this way. I know your son's story. You should know my daughter's. In the service of a cruel god, I was tricked into destroying a village, not knowing my own wife and child were there until their blood stained my hands. I swore revenge. That's... I can't imagine. I paid back their blood a thousand times and burned Olympus to the ground. Yet, the guilt remained. Perhaps you will kill me, Freya. But it will bring you no peace. Perhaps it is not peace at stake. All no. those times I found you, why'd you refuse to fight me? Every outcome would mean defeat. What does that mean? I have never wished you harm, Freya. You helped us. You saved Atreus when he was sick. I did not wish to live with killing you any more than I wished to die. I see. Yeah. It sounds like you gotta have a little perspective there, Freya. You hear that? Sounds like it might be grim. Noken! And so close to the village! Their song no. makes their allies invulnerable! They will not let you pass unless you no. destroy them all! No. 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 to play hide-and-seek with Freya and the crops. We'd spend afternoons stealing honey bread from the Grand Hall. At harvest time, we'd dance and feast no. until the sun rose. It was all so simple. Why did I have to come back? We have to be reminded of all this. Well, you wanted your freedom. The Grand Hall. It's in ruin. May Freya never waver. The other half is missing. May she protect us always. An old adage, if you will. Fairly simple one. I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out. Ah, oh, damn. Ah, Ah, son of a bitch. <laughs> Right, 
Keep moving. Desecrated every memory I have of home. Be glad you have a home to remember fondly. In Sparta, we were taken from our homes as children and raised in the Agoji. We marched or we drowned, fought for scraps or starved. Our elders beat us till we could not stand. At night, we made our way home, alone, or were food for wolves. That is how Spartans are made. <laughs> He's just giving her the full, like, hey, shut the fuck up and be glad. Getting through that. Or maybe that's exactly how we're supposed to go. <laughs> These plants behave similarly to the scorn poles we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. Oh my god. Oh no, I didn't know I was still in the in the range of it. Oh my god. These plants behave similarly to the scorn poles we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. <laughs> well, considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's fate. I thought I could change it. 
You know well how that worked out. The Norns. <coughs> the fates of these lands. That's right. <coughs> you defy prophecy at your own peril. Where's the uh... <coughs> Atreus would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to a fate the giants foretold. He disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to fight at Ragnarok. What? I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no champion of the giants. It is one glory concealed. Because of this champion, the realms are saved at Ragnarok. Only Asgard falls, and Odin with it. So all this time... Odin's obsession with every detail of Ragnarok, he's been missing a crucial piece. Yeah. Ha! Well done, bro. Atreus will not be a pawn of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? Is my tragedy not enough of a lesson? Fighting fate is a waste of the precious time we're given to spend with them. Whatever you we say. Never know when someone will come along and cut it short. Hey. All right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, thanks very much for joining me. When we do return, we will uh, continue on looking for a way to break this damn curse uh on freya but until then i think you so much for watching if you're on youtube please like comment subscribe to drop me a follow if you haven't already and i will be back in a moment uh wait yeah d don't don't spoil me <laughs> or and don't talk about spoilers either jesus i'm playing the game i'll be back in a second mm -hmm.